Two days after its glass front doors were shattered by gunfire, Elsa's on the Park restaurant is back open for business in downtown Milwaukee. Server Steve Bellmeyer showed up for work today with a grazed wound to his forehead. He was hurt when two shooters opened fire on a man picking up a to-go order. I was waiting for my drinks. The, I heard pop, 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 glasses flying everywhere. I uh, hit the dirt. I touched my head. The, the blood was coming out of my head. And then I just um, crawled away. And by then it was over. The other man who was hurt is expected to be okay, and so far no arrests have been made. Now, Steve was determined to get back to work, but of course you can see he was visibly shaken. Uh, Longtime customers couldn't wait to show their support. Tonight, Mary McCarr talked to some of those first in line to dine. Looking through the glass at Elsa's Friday night, you'll find business as usual. But just hours before people were placing their orders, glass workers were placing the shattered doors from Wednesday night's shooting. Yeah. The restaurant was closed for 24 hours, but the midweek tragedy didn't stop these dedicated customers from waiting outside for its reopening. It's just great to come back out, support. Elsa's given so much to me and my family and to be able to come back when they maybe need it, maybe not, but uh, to say, hey, we all support you and we want to see brighter days ahead of us. Benjamin Jerkin has been dining at Elsa's for over three decades. He says his love for the place runs in the family. I've had the luxury of bringing my daughter here. Um, so we've had, in my family, four generations uh, dine at Elsa's over the years. For other fellow diners, there was also no question they'd be back to the Milwaukee staple. It sounded like it was a fairly targeted event and uh, really didn't dissuade me from coming down today. It's just a really nice place and the people that have worked here worked here a long time. <laughs> I'm very excited to come back. Milwaukee police say a man was walking out of Elsa's with a to-go order on Wednesday when two people who were allegedly parked outside came up to the restaurant's front doors and started firing. I, I couldn't believe it. I honestly couldn't believe it. While officers are still looking for the people involved in the targeted attack, Customers are encouraging everyone to keep up the support. Come down, grab a burger. It's one of the best in the city. And employees at Elsa's wasting no time serving the same good meals they've been handing out for decades. In Milwaukee, Miriam McCarr, TMJ4 News.